learn two different break steps with the lock turn. The first one is a basic straight time. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, seven. The second one is an owl men's variation. Eight, one, a two, three, a four, a five, seven. The first one is all straight time. It looks like this. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, seven. So we start right, stomp, step, kick, rock, step, cross, together. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, seven. So for this lock turn, we're just going to jump. When you cross, you want your knee to be pocketed into the other knee. So you're nice and stable, you've got some twist, and then you're just gonna release it and jump together. You don't wanna add a lot of movement of the torso, it'll be too much energy to manage. So just think, release the torso to come around so you're not turning very far. I'll show you from the front. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, seven. And when you jump, you want to land really solidly, just like you were doing a squat. Make sure you're not too far forward on your toes or you'll lose your balance out of the step. Almond's variation starts the same. Eight on the right, then you're going to triple step. One, a two. Now your left foot is in front. So again, eight, one, a two. Draw your right knee up and across your body, a little bit of cross body motion. So again, a one, a two, three, a four, a five, turn seven. Eight, one, a two, three, a four. So this is syncopated two. I'm gonna bring my right leg across. A five, I tap my left foot. Knees still pocketed into each other. And when you turn around, you can choose what foot you want to be on. You could be split weight, you could be on your right foot, you could be on your left foot, whatever you need for the next move. From the front, so you can see the cross body. A one, a two, three, a four, a five, seven. Mm -hmm.